the fuck does that even mean? Why, how does a tooth, why does a toothbrush have AI? All right, here's your mint, mister. Yes, sir. Let me see, thank you. Okay, let's put this to the side. All right, here we go. That one, nice. And then grab me, yeah. And the last one, the spicy mango habanero. No, no, that, yeah, dude. Nice job. So I just got back from taking Ruger to gymnastics and there's a, this is his third time going to gymnastics. He's two and a half, maybe almost three years old actually. And for the first two times, he didn't want to be in the class. He just wanted to roam around, do whatever he wanted to do. Now, why is that important? That's important because I wanted to give him that freedom. He's in a new place. There's so many new things that he can want to play with. And I want him to be able to get a grip that he can go and play with those things. But as it comes to the third session, we believe he needs to be in the class, following what all the other kids are doing, what the coaches are telling him to do, which is a tough decision to make because it means you're stopping a kid from exploring when they're just a kid. And that's the topic for today. Oh. I'll get back to this in a second, but this is a script for a video that I shot the other day. You've seen it in the vlog. It was the creating audiobooks for Ruger. Now I've been trying this type of video recently where I tell a story. Now my stories are unique. I think there's something special to the way I tell a story on TikTok, the way I create a video. But there's also something that I've never seen before in my kind of style where I do a like somewhat relatable or a crazy experience like a feet in lotion for 24 hours or making an audiobook for my son is that every story you hear or see or video you see is in first person. I did this and then I did that. What if it was, that's not the right way to, yeah, how do I? In a TikTok video, if I'm talking to the camera and you hear what I'm saying in the moment, that's gonna be first person, that has to be first person. But what if the voiceover which is the majority of the footage, is someone narrating the story of the character, me or SideQuest dad, doing the thing. So instead of, I enjoy reading, but I felt like I was back in school, it's SideQuest dad enjoyed reading, but he felt like he was back in school trying to prove he was a good reader. I think it's a small difference that gives me two things. It gives me one, dif a differentiator between anyone else's videos, because you just don't see it that way. And two, I get to talk about myself as the main character out of body. So where I'm trying to get a message across in these videos to people of either doing the things it takes to be a good dad or learning something from the experience. I get to talk about it, but because it's a step back removed, it's like I'm not putting myself on a pedal. So it's like someone else is putting side quest dad, me, on this pedestal. You see what I'm saying? I've tried it in a few videos, but I haven't tried it in any seriously viral type videos. And viral type video, I mean, it is by the concept of the video. Crazy concept plus this, we're gonna murder some people. I don't know what am I saying? I've seen a couple of ads on TikTok recently for this gum, a collaboration between Razor and 7-Eleven. Or is this five gum? It's five gum. It's meant to be mental focus. Smells tropically. While I work on this video, which I actually made some changes to that I'm quite proud of. I don't know if you heard of a lady called Nara Smith on TikTok. Huge TikToker, but she kind of like, very subtly rage baits her intros. So I could have an intro to this video of uh, SideQuest dad made his son an audiobook because he loves listening or loves reading. I'll read it better for you. SideQuest dad made his son an audiobook because he loves reading but he can't read in the car. It doesn't, it, it's not very triggering is it? It's not very, you're not, you're not like I want to listen to that. I don't want to watch that. SideQuest dad made his son's audiobooks because his iPad overheated or caught on fire. There's a couple of things to that that I think work. The way the world is, people, including myself actually, I'll be honest, look down on the parents that just serve their kid an iPad. And the inference of this is that they're iPad kids. And so like, how's an iPad kid gonna deal with an audiobook? And then I've got, I grab my books while my son's locked in the basement. 
<laughs> okay, let's get this gum in and uh, give you an update as to how things go. I also bought... It's got a good taste to it. Recharge mints, spicy mango habanero. What? And blackberry vanilla. Don't know what to make of those. This is vitamin B5, 6, 12, slash niacin, and green tea extract. I don't know where the energy comes from. <laughs> Let's find out. I'll set the timer so we can see how long I have this in for. Why did I put flipping chewing gum in when I'm about to take it out to record audio? We'll pause the timer. Cyquist dad made his son's audio book. Starting the timer again. It's been 31 minutes. I don't feel anything from this, so we're gonna go with another one. Shay's just sent me a video. <laughs> one of the more annoying things with Ruger, when he learned to like crawl, not crawl, but climb up on things, was getting into the fireplace. And Shay's just sent me a video of Kovi, our nine month old doing the same thing now. <laughs> so I'll send cry and laugh his faces, and then I'll send a gif of good luck from Taken. Perfect. Taste is nice, just energy focus. I mean, I did just edit all of the clips onto this without really thinking about anything else. So maybe, but I didn't feel anything. Not like the way you feel a monster or Adderall. Oh my gosh. I, I shouldn't say this, should I really? I love the feeling of Adderall. I know it's terrible, but I love that feeling. It's like, it, it feels how it feels when you're watching Limitless. Limitless. That's the movie, isn't it? Limitless? That sounds weird to say, doesn't it? Limitless. When like everything just like closes in and you feel hyper focused. Oh, I love that. But I told myself I would never stay on that. You see too many people stuck on it and I never want to be there. And I found just like finding ways around and bumbling, bubbling, bumbling, bumbling. I found there are other ways to maintain your focus. All right, I'm gonna watch this back. See if this second one does anything. Dude, this is my new favorite chocolate. This Tony's pretzel and toffee. If they did this in a dark chocolate, it would be over. Like pretzel bits and toffee bits in it. Why am I eating all this chocolate? Because it tastes good. But also, I saw an ad this morning for a toothbrush that's on sale at Costco. It's an AI overall B toothbrush. Shay and I need new toothbrushes. I thought it's a good idea for a video. Compare the Miss work that I did a while ago did a series on that, did like five, six million views. Compare the natural toothbrush, which is a very good hook for a video, to this AI powered toothbrush. We're really going from like Stone Age sticks <laughs> to the newest of the new. So we're gonna go and get that later. And I'm thinking part of the video is gonna be that I haven't cleaned my teeth in 24 hours, which is gross, I know. But I think that makes for a good test. And the interesting thing, okay, now where is it? Uh, Ruby's awake, hold on. Slight change of plans on the timing of things. I'm gonna assume the toothbrushes are, oh, here we go. There they are. Bloody hell, that was hot. These are them, where's the, with AI. What are you talking about, AI? Look at the size of this box. I want you to see the size of this box. This is absurd. Hi, with my toothbrush, I'd like to have all the cardboard in the world, please. Let's see how it does. So you got this one as well, but I don't see any AI. I, don't, I really don't know what the AI is gonna do, but there is the pricing. I feel like that box is even bigger. All right, where'd Shay go? I think up there. I didn't know you could make money off of these. I was just giving them to my wife for free. Big smile, Woogers. So this is the toothbrush. I'm sorry, we'll come back to the earwax removal. In fact, we might actually use that right now because, oh, dude, because this toothbrush is powered with AI. What the fuck does that even mean? Why, how does a tooth, why does a toothbrush have AI? It connects to your app as well. What? Smooth, Oliver. What is it, dude? What are you doing? So I thought, boy's got some juice in it. Duda, let's get some head, you know what I'm saying? Let's get a head, let's get a head on it. Shay can have the white one, because she's pure. Oh, in the box, by the way. 
black one, white one. What do you think? No, okay, it's got lots of different settings. I'm, dude, dude uh, can you chill? It's just a toothbrush, bro. Bro, it's just a toothbrush. What are you doing? Okay, it's pretty much out of battery, so I need to charge that. Uh, and we'll film that tomorrow. I want to edit the video for the grounds crew video at Sporting KC. I'm gonna do a shorter video to go on their account and then a longer version to go on my account. I think more of a story to go on my account and then more of what actually happens to go on their account. And then I noticed that the, or a friend told me the, the guy who heads up the grounds crew for the Chiefs, the Kansas City Chiefs, he's pretty active on Twitter, posting stuff about what they do. And these guys that I just worked with know him. And I was telling them how interesting it would be to look at the difference between a soccer grounds crew work and the football grounds crew work. So they're gonna try and set that up, we'll see. Could be a good in, could be an interesting video. And I wanted to script that today, but I can't, I'm, there's, I'm too overstimulated right now. What do you, what do you, are you still freaking out about the toothbrushes? You are, aren't you? Okay. Well, I'm not taking them out again. It's okay. See, so here's something I'm thinking about. For this video with the toothbrushes, I was gonna not brush my teeth for 24 hours and then compare the difference, but I think that can be an additional video. I think that part of the video is its own concept and gives a completely different storyline versus just doing it after a day of eating or like in the morning. So there's potentially three different videos there. And I don't mean that from a perspective of just stretching things out to make more content. I think those are three different. When you only have a minute to tell the story, you can't include much information in one minute of story the way I want to do it. So it makes sense to separate it out into three. Maybe I'll just see what the difference is in just using Mizwak and a toothbrush tomorrow morning and I'll just brush my teeth normally tonight. Yes, let's do that. I was gonna script out the grounds crew video, but it's not three. It wasn't 3.15, it was 4.15, so I'm not gonna do that. I'm gonna finish it for today and do that tomorrow. You know, I feel like this video might have been a little more boring because there wasn't as much as I was that I was doing. I didn't really get much from this respawn and this video, this today was about editing. Dude, get off that bouncy ball. No, today was about editing and getting some of these videos edited and scripted. I didn't really get that much done. Night, night.